Welcome to IBM Maximo Application Suite Technical Snippets brought to you by Starboard Consulting. This is part three in our video series and in this particular video let's look at our applications and specifically how we navigate within the list page. So as we're brought to an individual application, in this case I've gone to Asset, I can see all my action menu here on the left hand side and uh, with my queries over here up on top. And then over here is my list page and this menu is collapsible. But let me just bring up a query to get started and let's talk start with my Bedford Assets. So notice as I bring up my Bedford Assets, I can see all my list of records 537 to be exact, and I can navigate through this page by scrolling to the bottom and navigating, and you can see my record count is being updated. But now let's say I want to filter this a little bit more. So let's filter on location. I can come up here and I can select my value, brings up a lookup, I can see all my individual values, but let's just bring up BR and let's uh, filter on our HVAC system. Notice that I've selected BR200, but my record set stays the same. I need to refresh, and now my record set is refiltered to now show those individual records in BR200. If I select my first record, here is 11200, and I can use my arrow keys on the top toolbar menu to navigate between those individual records. If I come back, well, how do I get back to that list page? That's really interesting, right? I open up, let me do that again. I click on this arrow and then I select my list view and it comes up. So again, just a slightly different way of navigating between your individual records. I open that up comes back down here to list view. As I collapse my menu again, just to highlight, again, important points, you still have that beautiful download record or download feature where I can download my record sets to Excel, and then I can go ahead and look at my individual um, results. Another thing that oftentimes many people do, let me expand that one more time, is that we go ahead and we change status. Um, on a particular records in our set, very, very common. And that functionality is still available. You don't have to do it on an individual basis. You can do it on whatever record set that you had selected. So that's some base features and functionality with Maximo Application Suite and the list page of an application. Thank you.